Hi, it is September 19th. This is Janine Grigg. And um, update on my business today, I made um, probably about eight or nine cold calls. I set one appointment. Um, I, uh, I had two appointments. They both canceled. Um, both one because she has no money and can't buy anything and keeps telling me that um, <laughs> over and over again. So she wants to reschedule for a better time. And then the other one I was actually supposed to meet with to enroll. And I think it was kind of the same scenario, probably the no money thing. So um, she canceled and said that, you know, this is not a good time. So. But that was okay. I still went out. I did some marketing today for um, probably about four hours. So that was productive. So that was good. And um, oh, yeah. And then one thing I, I listened to um, about the law of attraction today was to what was it? The, to visual. I can't remember the exact words, but something about to visualize. Um, what you want to happen. So one of the big realizations that I had today was to visualize actually setting an appointment with someone who is interested in quality lead or cold call or whatever. So that was kind of exciting to me. So I'm actually going to um, do that. I have a, a few lists of things that I want to actually visualize cold calling someone and setting an appointment with someone that's interested and someone that you know sounds good over the phone or someone that you know has some experience or is a good personality because um, I kind of realized lately that a lot of the people that I'm calling are <coughs> excuse me um, I kind of realized that a lot of the appointments that I've had recently I feel like I'm begging for them and they're not necessarily the kind of people that I want to be working with. Um, so that's kind of not a good thing. Um, and, you know, I try and visualize my success and visualize, you know, what that will get me and where I will be in, you know, a couple of years from now or whatever. But I've never really visualized, oh, yeah, that was it, to visualize... Oh, what was it? I just lost my train of thought again. I'm sorry. I'm tired. It was to um, to visualize the... Oh, yeah. Okay. Like, to be realistic in your goals and have, you know, be realistic or unrealistic or whatever. And to be realistic, it ha to be realistic in your mind, you need to see it happening. If you can see it happening, then it's a realistic goal. If you can't, then it's unrealistic. So I was thinking about that for a minute, about the goals that I make. And in my mind, they're kind of unrealistic because I can't see them happening. But the part of it that I can't see happening is starts at the appointment. Um, for me, my biggest problem has always been not getting enough appointments. Once I have the appointments, I'm pretty good at, from that point forward. And once I have people to work with, I'm pretty good at working with them. But my problem is getting the appointments and honestly getting the, not even getting the appointments, getting the contacts and the right contacts and the right people and uh, talking to the right leads. So I'm going to visualize who I want to come into my business, visualize and what the conversation will look like, how what does it feel like? What do I say? How do I say it? Like, kind of like, you know, visualize carrying on a conversation with someone. So that was something really a big revelation for me today because that's something that I think I've almost, um, you know, for because of my fears and things like that, I think maybe I'm attracting the wrong kind of people because those are the kind of people I'm comfortable talking to. So, um, and that's, that's not good. I don't want to attract the wrong people. And there's absolutely no reason I call the people that I'm not quote unquote comfortable talking to. I just, you know, have yet to find one that is interested. So that's kind of what I'm going to work on. And my phone's ringing, so I got to run downstairs. So I got to go. Good night. Check back.